Okay, welcome back to part 3 of my video comparing Norton Intense Security 2011 against Komodo Intense Security 2011 and uh, I have restarted both computers now and uh, see here that um, Komodo gets a warning up uh, when I open the program I see that it's it's blocking here Defense Plus has blocked 1225 intrusion so far um, and now this this cloud scanner alert comes up and um, it tells me here uh, cloud behavior suspicious one malicious malware has been detected um, here I can I can click this on this link and then I'm coming to uh, another web page where I get some information about it uh, yeah, some diagnosis as it looks like. Don't understand so much. But I can close this again. I can click on clean and um the second one blocked suspicious one. So it definitely gets some warning and you see the firewall is blocking some access as it looks like. Running the process explorer, and we still have those programs here running. It's but if you check it, yeah, I don't know where those or those are running. Whether they are running in sandbox or let me see activity lists partly limited. Yeah, they are partly limited running. Well, how do I close this? Terminate and block. But I think the most of the users will even not re realize that those profiles are running in the sandbox. But what I will do now is that I will run a scan. And I can only do a f full system scan as it looks like. So. Uh, I will run the scan and to make an equal test uh, I will also run here on the Norton machine not a quick scan I will run a full system scan um, this is also just restarted and um, we will see when those scans are finished what we finish what we will find well, uh, back here I just want to show you Komodo is now since over 4 minutes scanning the system and stuck at the 4th or 5th file uh, which is running in um, RAM sandboxed but anyway now, now it's continuing but it really it takes a lot of time it's really really slow if you compare that with Norton uh, already scanned 22,000 files started to scan at the same time uh, it's already in the Windows folder so Norton will probably soon be finished and uh, so somehow Komodo is really uh, heavily infected even if this is sandboxed but I think many of the users will not know how to handle the sandbox feature I don't know how it's with the instructions, but I will let this video go or scan go and whip back when, when at least Norton is finished to see how far has Komodo come then. Okay, uh, Norton Intense Security finished scanning uh, 49,610 files and uh, no risks, no virus found. Um, so and the system is running as normal let's see in memory we don't have any fake or yeah malware process is running even if this one malware got through and if you look back at <laughs> Komodo it's scanning now since 17 minutes and uh, has so far scanned 32 files <laughs> So uh, I, I will stop this scan now here because uh, it's no meaning to continue with it.
uh, even stopping takes time. <laughs> well, uh, I will just pause the video for some more minutes. Well, just to show you, since two minutes I'm stopping the scan and nothing is happening. Um, uh, we see the process is running here, occupying processor usage. Um, I will leave let this go for some more minutes. Uh, in the meantime, uh, I'm scanning with uh, Mavobytes on the Nord installation. <coughs> okay, uh, Mavobytes is just scanning here on the Norton machine. Back to Komodo. Pff, nothing is happening here. Uh, okay, now I could stop that scan. But uh, I will try now and go into this active process list and uh, see where we have, here we have those programs and uh, terminate them so that we get uh, more free memory again and uh, I will see <laughs> what whether I can try start a second scan with Komodo stopping but everything those are running in the sandbox and occupying the system resources anyway so okay uh, now we start again and we still have warnings here from plus defense 6065 already uh partly unlimited okay sandbox settings I'm not changing anything. I will try another scan now to see how far this stay or oh this now is updating the signature at the same time and uh, I will let this scan go. see when it starts, how fast it's going I will pause the video ok, now the scan starts and as you see it, it's going much faster now since I have removed those programs out of sandbox or terminated them uh, now it's starting really scanning really fast. Uh, I let this go and we'll be back when this scan is finished. Okay, um, Komodo finished scanning after eight, nearly nine minutes. Yeah, fifty-eight thousand files and found three threads. Um, in Tamp and. Uh, yeah, this uh, fraud is anti spyware. Uh, clean them. Yes. Okay. Um, now I will run a scan with uh, Merobytes and we'll be back when this is finished. Alright, back here uh, with Komodo. Um, my robots stopped scanning, finished scanning and find eight infected objects still on the system. Uh, some files were possible to install. Here those files are also on the system. Rogue antivirus, eight files. If we go to uh, Norton, there it's the scan also finished and found four and this is the spy pass spyware password program uh, which got through so four detections on the computer with um, Norton and eight 
on the computer with um, Komodo. Uh, what I will do now is that I will install um, Hitman Pro on both computers and do a scan with Hitman Pro. Okay, Hitman Pro is finished scanning and uh, on the computer with uh, Komodo installed we have 12 threads remaining on the system uh, some Trojan and uh, yeah real malware as you see here in total 12 13 cases and if you check um, semantic we have those uh, programs here it's a spam tool and this is suspicious this add aware I have installed here but in total eight, six identified threads and uh, so if you compare six to twelve and we had four uh, I don't remember it was how much it was a Komodo I think eight four against eight Norton against Komodo four against eight and here we have um, um, six against twelve remaining objects on the system so uh, Norton you have to pay for Komodo is for free and um, I still think that uh, Norton is the better product uh, you get less warnings the, autom the program is automatically removing viruses and uh, yeah if you look at um, Komodo um, it has the sandbox feature but nearly every virus you found you have to make your own decision suggesting to block it or to put it in sandbox but a lot of user interaction is um, needed and um, okay it's a free product but as you have seen I restarted the computer and the malware was still running in the sandbox but system was slow and uh, I th I pretty think that that Norton did here uh, a much better job than Komodo. So uh, that's everything from me for today. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, see you soon. Bye bye.